welcome welcome back yesterday we have coded the amo and will do system and today we'll be covering on the fire mode of the gun now uh, today we are going to code two modes first is the automatic and the second one is semi-automatic and probably going to add some burst fire too now without further ado, let's start now open your visual studio or any of the code editor program now down here i'm going to add a new public public in gun mode now i'm going to make some comment here so i don't get lost which is which so one is a uh, let's just say if one is full auto second is semi auto and third is burst fire all right <clears throat> now on the void start i'm going to make the gun mode default to one which is full auto now, down here on the void update add a new uh, input uh, check key get key down which is if input get key down now what key do you want to be the fire mode toggle will be I'm going to set Q or it could be anything so if get key down Q um, if gun mode is lower than now since we have three gun mode and I'm going to add it is if gun mode lower than three gun mode is plus plus and else down here if gun mode uh, we can't just do else we need is an else if gun mode is equal to 3 um, is equal to 3 gun mode is equal 1 we want it to go back to the very beginning we don't want it to go 4 since there's no fourth mode so yeah this should be good all right um, where is it no over here we want to um, cut this first just control X and then just put a new if statement here if gun mode is equal to 1 and then just repaste it back now that's all and then down here put in else statement if um, and else if gun mode is equal to 2 it's a semi-automatic so just copy this line of code we paste it and just change this get key to get key down another else if down here else if gun mode is equal to 3 just re just copy this we want it to go to semi-automatic and what do you want to do now just remove this one and add a new function here called burst fire just we copy that um, we want this to go to the burst fire function and up here I'm going to do is public in shot number if shoot shot a uh, shootable and and um, what was the variable call again uh, shot number is lower than no, yeah, short number is lower than 
3 which is burst fire it only three bullet um what okay now we don't want to put it over there what we want to put is um where is it yeah this this the shooting yield so we want to uh, remove this one shootable not remove just uh, cut it first if five uh, mo gun mode is not equal to three we want to do shootables false else So we, we, uh, we, we are going to do something if the, the gun mode is on burst fire so on the burst fire mode which is down here when they shoot uh, we want it just to do this um, mm, shot num plus plus and then we shoot it So you want gun mode is not equal to three, um, or uh, why can't I? Um, there yeah, or, which is that symbol? You can find it above enter. Just press shift and that button. I don't know what is that symbol called. So gun mode is not equal to three or. or shot number is equal to 3 I'm going to make sure the ball is false and shot num to 0 um, you want to let the player know on what mode is their gun at so so I'm going to put above here public text gun mode text um, on the void update uh, under the backup aimo text.txt we want to do is gun mode text.txt is equal to is equal to um, gun mode dot to string Okay, that should work now. So let's test it. Now I'm on why is object reference not set? Oh yeah, uh, I forgot. Go to your FPS control or wherever you put your gun script. Uh, I mean shooting script, and I'm going to rename this um, gun mode. Now just drag your gun mode to the gun mode text. Save it. Now it should be one. One is the uh, fully automatic. Now if I press Q, it should go to two, which is uh, I'm pressing my mouse one by one. Um, yep, I'm pressing my mouse one by one. Wait, somewhat, somehow it's shooting really slow. Gonna change to get key up. So if if the player hold it down on this one, yeah, it's working. Now on the third one, the burst fire. It's not doing anything. Why is that? Else, if gun mode equal three, burst fire. If shootable, it's 
should, you should go to the burst fire. Or I have a better idea. What if we delete? Just scroll down to the shooting yield. Yield this one and delete this one. Yield this one. If gun mode is equal to 3. Oops, my bad. Shooting num shot numbers and then just reshoot it. No, I forgot. It's, it should not go to shoot. Should go to burst fire. That's why it's not working. Now on the void update, just put it down here. If shot num is equal to three. Uh, why is it like this? If shot num is equal to three, and then don't forget on the burst fire. Remove the shootable is equal to false. We want here on shot num is equal to 3. If it's 3, shot num is equal to 0. And shootable back to true. Wait, you don't need to make shootable back to true because it's never. Uh, it never falls it, right? Yeah, yeah. Shoot burst fire. And it go to burst fire. It directly go to shoot. Doesn't matter. Shooting yield on shooting yield. If it's gun mode three, we'll add the shot num and back to the burst fire. Now, um, over here where the gun mode three and shot num is equal is lower than or equal than zero, or just make it zero. Now should work now. No. If I change my gun mode to burst fire, it doesn't stop shooting. Very nice. Let me see what's wh wh what is the problem here. Uh, just make if shootable. Not shootable. Uh, shot num is lower than three. No, yep, it's shooting three bullets at a time. Yep, it's shooting three bullets at a time. Oh, I'm reloading. As you can see, it's working fine right now. I wonder what if oh, it doesn't do anything when you hold it out on you when you hold it. Yep, this is uh, what is expected. You're going to just to shoot three bullets at a time. If I go to fully automatic, I, sh I, I I'm able to shoot. A lot of bullet and if I go to a semi-automatic I can shoot one by one I wonder what if I have like not an odd number of ammo just shoot one bullet so what happened we'll go to negative one it, it does go to negative one so what we're going to do down here Shot num burst fire. So it's shot num. If uh, current ammo is lower than three, no, it's bigger than three. It's bigger than zero. Yeah, he'll just shoot two bullets. Okay, let me just reload the gun. I'm gonna shoot. I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna recheck it, just in case. Oh. Now on the reload. Where is reload? Reload. Where is reload? Reload. Um. Num shot num is equal to zero. Because just now I, I can't shot the bullet because the shot num is not zero since in the code uh, shot num must be zero before we can shoot anything. 
so just in case so people doesn't spam the burst fire so I'm gonna eat it only shoot it's sh it, it only supposed to shoot two bullet it does uh, when I reload I'm able to shoot the burst fire back yep um, that's about it tomorrow or uh, um, in, in next video we are going to make the sound so every time you reload there's going to be sound every time you shoot there's going to be sound so yeah stay tuned